Welcome to Code 134 at PSNS and IMF. We're a fully accredited state-of-the-art laboratory that provides the Navy with accurate and timely materials testing and technical expertise. Our team is comprised of chemists, chemical and material engineers, technicians, and support staff. This video will give you a brief overview of the four branches that make up our talented laboratory division. The analytical chemistry branch supports environmental and some non-environmental testing in the shipyard. Code 134.1 conducts Clean Water Act analyses, testing water from metals, oil and grease, petroleum hydrocarbons, volatile organic compounds, mercury and cyanide. We also support industrial hygiene and waste testing, analyzing asbestos, PCB, and metal samples. Additionally, Code 134.1 provides a variety of non-environmental testing, such as PCB swipe analysis, providing equipment and surface cleanliness, air and welding gas testing, and quantitative analysis of chemical compositions for metal alloys. We also offer evolved gas analysis that helps Code 106 identify potential compounds volatized during welding and supports 134.5's unknown ID analysis. Code 134.4 is a combination of two unique programs in the Navy, the Radiochemistry Program and the Nuclear Water Chemical Inspection Program, or NWCIP. The Radiochemistry Program collects data on every active nuclear vessel in the Navy, guided by the rules and regulations of the Water Chemistry Control Manual. This manual directs ship's force to periodically sample the primary coolant and send it to Puget Sound Naval Shipyard for analysis. Our radiochemists test the samples for dissolved and undissolved levels of metallic elements and radionuclides in the primary system. Naval reactor engineers then use that information to monitor the health and lifetime of each boat's core. NWCIP chemists analyze and certify all chemicals used in the primary and secondary systems aboard naval nuclear vessels. Their main purpose is ensuring these chemicals meet the strict specifications required by the Navy. Following rigorous standards from the American Chemical Society and ASTM International, we use a variety of analytical techniques including gravimetry, titrimetry, chromatography, colorimetry and turbidimetry, trace and ultra-trace elemental analysis, and measurement of physical properties. Code 134.4 also assists ship's force with article testing and troubleshooting product quality deficiency reports. The Nuclear and Waterfront Chemistry Branch tests a variety of samples, including ship services, such as pure water and hydraulic fluid. We also provide APL and QPL product cleanliness testing and unknown material identification. Code 134.5 tests thousands of water samples each year, most commonly for grade A analysis, which typically includes conductivity, chloride, pH, and silica. Chloride is detrimental to metal surfaces, leading to corrosion and damage. In this quick test, if chloride is present, a white powder is formed, visible as cloudiness or turbidity. The shipyard has treatment facilities for wastewater. To be sure the treatment process works, a jar test is performed on wastewater samples. In this simulation, any heavy metal should start to precipitate and ideally settle to the bottom. The Detrimental Materials Program tests a variety of products for addition to the APL and QPL product lists. Some products are leach tested, where the sample is cut into pieces and heated in water. That water is then tested. Other products require a total analysis, where the sample is completely mineralized through combustion or heated acid digestion. 
The resulting ash or residue is then dissolved in water or acid, and that liquid is tested. Code 134.6 performs a variety of physical properties testing within the field of metallurgy. This branch is also responsible for the Shipyard Alloy Identity Program and metallographic inspection of welds. The Alloy Identity Program ensures the shipyard is using the correct metal alloys for intended applications. This program also includes training code 133 and 139 inspectors to perform acid spots for verifying material. Acid etching is conducted in the lab to reveal metallurgical features such as grain structure. On the waterfront, acid etching is used to expose weld features, as well as dissimilar metal boundaries such as stainless steel welded to high-yield steel. Welding samples are cross-sectioned and polished to inspect for defects like voids, cracks, and oxides. We also provide failure analysis services, not only on metal components, but polymer and ceramic samples as well. A scanning electron microscope is used to study fracture surfaces and identify foreign material particles. Code 134.6 also performs hardness, tensile, and other testing to provide objective quality evidence the materials used within the shipyard meet proper specifications. For additional information on Code 134, please visit us on our SharePoint site.